Alright, so we're back for what may or may not be the last episode of Harry Potter for the Next. So we're going to go through the 7th, half the 7th, and the 8th year. Um, let's get this panel out. Uh, but yeah. So, the main reason why we couldn't record as many videos as we wanted with Sarah was because um, my memory on my phone isn't very good. Or my camera, really. Um, my camera's great. My phone is not too too much. Um, yeah, so we're just going to finish this game off, and actually, if you didn't read the description from the last uh, part, uh, I will probably be uploading a small four-part series on LEGO Jurassic World, which I recorded before this, actually, but it just wouldn't load for some reason, and if it does, that'd be great. If not, I'll just cancel it. Okay, now we're going to go to Journey to the Strange Vault. Um, this one took a very long time, I must say, so we might have to cut this one, just due to time. Um, so there's a lot, there's the cafe, which you guys missed, but we got a four star on that one, and we thankfully completed it. This one is going to be slightly tricky, but with my experience with it, I should be done with it quickly. And we won't be in the actual vault, we'll just be on the cart the vault. Um, and of course remember we fought Lestrange before. Believe that one of Voldemort's Horcruxes is hidden in the Lestrange vault at Gringotts. With Hermione disguised as Bellatrix, Ron disguised as an older wizard, and Harry and Griphook hidden under the invisibility cloak, they break into the bank to retrieve the Horcrux. And if you didn't hear that you can just pause the video here and read it, but we got to hurry, because it's like 7, 8 in the morning. Yep, there's Harry. And, uh, I really like the kind of details that they added to the movie, like, or the, the actual cutscenes. Wouldn't it be kind of cool if, like, they actually showed the real, um, movie clips? But, that's just me, you know. This came out a long while ago, so probably not. They can't really... Just re finish it, but. So, you know. The reason that I liked like, Jurassic, Jurassic World was mainly because it showed the actual audio compared to most LEGO games. It just really has just a normal voice actor. I can't it's kind of weird. At least that was cool, they're very horribly timed, so. Jump. Jump.
reason that I wanted to get this game, not just because I had extra money, but also because I went to Universal Studios in Orlando, Florida. It's beautiful there. I'm not even. Oh, sorry. I was looking ahead. Um, it's so. Oh, it's really nice there. And like, it's all. It's most of the time really sunny. Like really sunny. Gryffindor colors, even though it's a Chewbacca shirt. It has like the rims of uh, red and gold. But you know, I just thought it'd be cute. Cause it, I don't have any Harry Potter shirts. The only Harry Potter thing that I got from Orlando was a pen, a feather pen, and a backpack. The staff and students vigorously defend the school, putting the magical shield up around the castle to protect. I think this one you're just running from Death Eaters. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this is about it. I love the design of the Death Eaters. They look pretty cool, actually. They like the Dream Reapers. I guess that was the main design idea for it. I don't know. It's just demons itself. Basically, you need to go left and right, jump, and then you die. Basically, the controls for like jumping, ducking, moving left to right is about the same, unless you're like looking for a pet I don't know. If, yeah, I know we got that one on camera. Um, and basically, what you do is like you, you're leaning your top, the top of your body to turn, but in this one, you actually have to like, move your entire body. And the duck ears go down pretty easy. Potter uh, for Kinect that actually has commentary. I don't know. Oh, there you go. I jumped too early because I'm like, I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh, I have to jump. And sometimes it'll occur like two obstacles. Oh, I'm 
going to try again. Because, <laughs> yeah, we're at 10 minutes, so let's stop it there. Um, I don't think you have to beat it to pass on. I think it's just how many stars that you get. But yeah, I'd like to thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in part 9, I think. 9? I don't know. Some part. <laughs> or the next part. I'll see you all later.